What's going on, boys? <laughs> Today we got Town Hall 10 on deck. Clash Cup, $1,500 on the line. We're going to get to see some of the best attacks in the world today. All right, so this has been one of the most predominant attacks thus far in the tournament with the Queen Charge, Pekka with the Witches, and the Surgical Hog on the back end. We're going to see an Earthquake spell placed up top. Lightnings to eliminate the Inferno Tower, which is set to single target mode, which opens it up perfectly for the Queen Charge. Queen Charge used to clear various buildings and set a path for the P.E.K.K.A.s. Queen's going to take out this Elixir Storage, keep walking towards the left, taking on the Barracks. Wall Breakers will open up the wall for this Queen. She's going to have to deal with some Ground Set Skeleton Traps. Going after the Town Hall, she'll also have to deal with the Expo and Wizard Tower. Or, or will this Queen keep walking? <laughs> we saw that earlier. Nope. That's a good thing. Queen takes on the Town Hall. Wall Breakers drop to get our P.E.K.K.A.s into the base. Followed up by the Balloon and Bowlers from the Clan Castle. Barbarian King should be placed on the far left on the Mortars location, but we'll see. Jump spell down. There goes the King and the Wizard. Queen's busy on an expo. Free spell down for the single. Hopefully this queen will join the group. Freeze again. Nicely done. Packers are going to get in there and take down the single target. Bowlers are locked onto the defensive queen, and she is gone fast. Barbarian King is at the bottom of the base. Surgical Hog dropped on the Wizard Tower to eliminate it and assist the Witches. Wizard Towers will roast skeletons that protect the Witch. Barbarian King's ability will need to be used. He still has an Offensive Queen ability. Pekkas are cutting through a wall and realistically we have one major end defense that's the problem here which would be the Expo. King ability. He's holding on to two Hog Riders down there. Trying to assist with the cleanup. Queen's going to come around. Here comes a Hog Rider on the Wizard Tower to protect the Witches. There we go. Well done. Queen ability still available. Will he swag it? I don't even think he needs it. Nope, he's just going to go ahead and use it to help take down these final buildings with the Expo. Beautiful attack here from History Repeats. Amazing work. And that's how you use that army. It's probably one of the best armies right now at Tunnel 10 with no siege machines. Here we go. We're going to see a Queen Charge Lalo with the Zap Quake. Earthquake spell down and the lightnings to destroy the single target Inferno Tower. Clan Castle troops being baby dragon goblins and witches. Queen's going to have to deal with that. Rage her up to get her through this engagement. Barbarian King. Queen, battling it out versus the Larrys and the Witch. Witch will go down. Barbarian King there to assist. He'll go back the other direction. Wall Breakers down on the bottom. Successful on the compartment entry. Nice Wall Breakers on the left to get that Queen up into the next compartment, but she's going to have to deal with the defensive Queen. Ability used to take on the defensive queen. Success. Defensive queen is down. Defensive king. Doesn't really matter in a la low, but still. He is down. No, he doesn't go down, actually. <laughs> Psych. Lava loon coming in from the right. There goes our hound and balloons going up into the bomb tower. Expo next. Large group of balloons coming from the backside going into mortars, hidden Teslas. Hidden Tesla will be successful and shut down some balloons. Rage in the core. Taking on the air sweeper. Sweepers down. Single target still standing in a wizard tower. Queen's locked onto the wizard tower. One air defense remaining. He needs this single to fall. Singles locked onto the lava pup. Beautiful pop. Clean up troops and distractions for our balloons. Final building being the Archer Tower on defense. Town Hall in the core. This is a beautiful attack here from Adi Brown. Town Hall is down. Altar's down. Building's up top. 
There's your three star right there. Another solid Queen Charge Lalo with the lightning spells and Quake use. Here we are. Next attacker will be bringing that Mass P.E.K.K.A. Earthquake spells down, granting access to the center of this base. P.E.K.K.A. down on the bottom, trying to do a little bit of funneling. This army has been used various times throughout the tournament as well, sometimes finding great success and sometimes not so much. Seven P.E.K.K.A. attack. Three P.E.K.K.A.s up top, leading for the Wizards. We got some P.E.K.K.A.s in the center. Bowlers with the Queen and King. Surgical Hogs going in to assist with the clearance of an Expo, but having to deal with a Bomb Tower in the process. Bowlers in the core, getting a bounce on the Bomb Tower, gonna take it out, well done. Nice play here by the Bowlers. Barbarian King ability, Queen is stuck on a wall. That's about right. Defensive Queen's gonna get taken out by the spawns from the Barbarian King. And the Archer Queen taking down the Expo. This is looking good. This is looking really good. <laughs> Nicely done, nicely done. Pekka's on the outside. Only a cannon mortar. Minute and 39 seconds this is a very fast paced attack. Queen's ability used to take out the mortar. Pekka's will eliminate the cannon. And this, my friends, will be a triple. Well done from Lowly at Night. We're gonna see, ugh, ugh, we're gonna see a Falcon. Let's see what Mr. Kenneth does here with the Falcon. Queen charge from the top, taking on gold storage, going into the fast pace Archer Tower. Two single target Inferno Towers in the center of this base. Hidden Tesla. Rage spell, protect this queen. Somebody's calling for the fail. Queen's gonna negotiate into two expos at once. And an archer tower. Baby dragon on the far left. Try to funnel a little bit. Queen's health is riding dangerously low. Wall breaker entry successful. Queen's ability has to be used. Valkyries, Bowlers, Giant coming from the Clan Castle. Well, not the Valkyries, but you know. Jump spell down, leading the Valkyries directly into the Town Hall. Will they take it? <laughs> that is the question here. Dragon in the air. Locked onto Valkyries. Valkyries finding giant bombs everywhere. Pretty typical. Raise spell down. Single still up. Valks are going to take out the defensive king. There we go. Bowlers and Valks going to kick outside of that compartment. Queen's locked onto an expo. Barbarian King is looking very nice at the bottom of the base with the Witches. Surgical Hogs coming in, assisting with the clearance of a cannon. Over there working on a Wizard Tower. Valkyries, looks like there's two left on the top right. Spring Trap found. Barbarian King's ability is still available. Queen still has the healers. Fifty-six seconds left in the attack. Hog Rider still in the queue with one freeze. Very patient attacker here. Freeze spell down to assist that hog. Queen is going to be stuck on a wall. Hog Rider on the cannon. Will he be successful? No, but there's other troops to assist. Well done. This is only like the second Falcon that we've seen be successful throughout this entire last two days. So. It's, it's good, but the bases have to be set up perfectly for it, like this situation here. Which was Lonely at Night. Which is going in with their first attack right now. We're going to see Zap Dragons. Last attack was not very successful with this army, but let's see. Well, that might have been the other team. <laughs> the last time we saw this army wasn't necessarily the greatest option. But we'll see if this one is. Going to send the dragons directly into some high hit point buildings and a single target, but that's what the balloons are for.
Barbarian King on the far right side. More than likely an Archer Queen will be dropped as well. Raise spell down for our dragons. Dragon in the core got taken out by the defensive Archer Queen. And it looks like our dragons are going to push outside. Going around to the other Inferno Tower. There we go. Heal spell down in the core. Defensive Queen is gone. Dragons will be successful with the elimination of that defensive queen and moving through the backside of this base. Archer queen ability used. The only thing left here is an X-Bow and two wizard towers. This is looking very solid for the three. Nice dragon party through the backside. Beautiful attack. We see a three star from this zap dragon. Well done. Here we go. Our next attacker from History Repeats coming in with a Zap Quake Witch Slap. Earthquake spells successful with the elimination of the Inferno Towers, which opens up perfectly for our Golems. Golem's blocking for those witches, but the witches will take some damage since we do have multiple mortars on this side. No scout for the wall breakers. Descending three in at a time. Center compartment does not open. Oh, no, it did open. My, my apologies. I can barely see it. Golem's king, queen. Bowlers from the clan castle, which is on a wizard tower. Dragon in the poison. No jump spell here. We do not have a jump to link this base together, so they're going to have to cut through walls. Another situation where we have to wait for troops to bang through walls. Double expo coverage on the opposite side, locked onto the bowlers. Not a good thing. Free spell down for the bomb towers. Bomb Towers will take out those Larrys really, really fast. Down goes one Bomb Tower. We still got to deal with double Expos. Barbarian King's ability used. Queen's ability still available. Here comes some Hog Riders to assist on the back, taking on the Archer Tower and Hidden Tesla. Expo one down. Hog Riders might be able to move in on the next Expo and take it out. Surgical Hog failure up top. Expo still rocking. Baby Dragon, down on the bottom near the timer, trying to assist. The Queen's ability will need to be used. This is not good. That Expo needs to fall. Witches are working on the Expo. They will be successful. Golem gets back in the league to block the defensive King. Archer Queen is gone. No Archer Queen. The rest of this attack is entirely up to the Surgical Hogs and Witches. Baby Dragon. Hog successful with one hidden Tesla. The next one, or the Archer Tower will fall, and then the final hidden Tesla will go down next. Nice work. Very close, though. Very close three-star attack. 